Hello, and welcome to the Kansas State Veterinary Diagnostic Lab YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss blue-green algae, or cyanotoxicity, in cattle. Blue-green algae can be blue, bright green, brown, or red. It can look like scum, foam, or a mat on the surface of the water. It also may look like paint floating on the water. Do not confuse blue-green algae with plant growth like moss, duckweed, etc. Cyanobacteria produce neurotoxins and hepatotoxins. Clinical signs can range from dizziness, difficult breathing, weakness, diarrhea, to sudden death. Necropsy findings, a nutmeg liver, or unremarkable. Causes. Cyanobacteria live in surface waters in low concentrations and normally cause no problems. During certain weather conditions, these bacteria produce a harmful bloom where the concentrations rise to a level where toxicity can occur. These conditions include municipal and agricultural runoffs, warm temperatures in late summer and early fall, and low wind speeds. Sampling. A water sample of at least 100 ml, including the water one inch below the surface. When collecting water, gloves should be worn, as some cyanobacteria produce dermatotoxins. A rumen fluid sample of at least 200 ml. Both water and rumen fluid samples should be refrigerated before shipping. Do not freeze as this will lyse the cyanobacteria. Liver samples. Please submit sections of formalized liver less than one half inch thick. Diagnosis. A presumptive diagnosis can be made from clinical signs and water source appearance. Microscopy of water and rumen samples can confirm. Histopath on liver samples can also be confirmatory. KSVDL offers histopathology and microscopy to aid in your diagnosis and management of this disease. Contact Client Care at 785-532-5650 for more information on these tests.